topic today i'm going to talk about is the how dynamic economy like uae has to be powered by a durable software and that is the theme today and and zoho combines this dynamism powered by durability this is the theme of zoho itself so i'll talk about this first of all i just wanted to tell you where i am right now i am in a remote village in tenkasi district in southern india for those of you who are from india this is uh, not very far from the southern tip it's about 90 kilometers from the tip of southern tip of india so this is my normal life daily life here in a in a village there so and uh, let's dive into the presentation and uae economic and business landscape first i'll just briefly go over this um, it's one of the most dynamic and complex markets in the world and what does it mean there's a way the economists measure these things and uh, it's close dominated by trade and investment and you can see the numbers explain this external trade is 125% of uae gdp that number jumps back at you because if you look at a country like india it's 28% of gdp so clearly you know when you see a uae economy it's a much more external trade dominated economy and uh, that's what is captured by the 125% of gdp here and what it also means and for example uae with 10 million approximately 10 million people is also one of the largest exporter 16th largest exporter and 20th largest importer but its external trade is actually of similar order as all of india so which gives you a perspective on uae's uh, economic landscape and uh, this complex economy means that companies in uae need to move fast to seize opportunities that's what this complex and dynamic economy really means that you have an external trade dominated economy and that means that you are immediately affected by whatever is going on around the world and that means that you have to move quickly when some new developments arise and that is the nature of uae economy and operating in uae that's what it really means and in this i'm going to say fast moving companies when you are in such a dynamic regime you have to have a durable software platform and what do i mean by the durable well a platform that doesn't make you think about the platform itself so that is key because if you have software that you have to constantly uh, maintain and troubleshoot that's not software that's going to work for a very complex dynamic business you just don't have the time and uh, you have to you know the, the, particularly in trading you are you know you have to buy and sell faster and and investment decisions have to be made faster so a platform that forces you to think about the platform itself is high maintenance platform and you cannot act, you cannot have that in this uh, type of an economy or in uh, in the technology to borrow this from steve jobs you need software that just works and that is what precisely that we offer and we are able to offer this because we are built on a durable foundation and i'll go over this uh, in some depth what that durable foundation means but that's the real power behind zoho that's built on a durable foundation durable foundation in terms of our software and in terms of the culture that built so i'll talk about this a little bit and this durability is necessary to power your dynamism as a company that uh, your ability to move fast comes directly from our durability as a platform and it also comes from our unique approach to business all of this comes from that unique approach to business which where we combine a culture along with the technology so first uh, this is actually the one of the foremost elements of this we have a common underlying technology framework this is hugely important if you look at all our products whether it's crm whether it's chat whether it's email and our this presentation tool even this event i am presenting this on our zoho backstage platform all of these are actually powered by an underlying technology framework that we wrote ourselves and that is important because that's the only way that we can ensure the depth of quality in other words most companies if you look at most companies they will acquire all these pieces and bolt them on 
and that's very common in our industry that you'll have a lot of disparate pieces acquired one of this is written in java another is written in python another is written in uh, ruby on rails they'll acquire those and put them together and that cannot be durable because you actually have eventually you have to move to a common platform common technology framework in order to get any kind of productivity and technology in your technology investment most companies never get there because they are constantly you know feeding this multiple underlying software infrastructure while in zoho we have built all our 50 plus products in the zoho suite on a common underlying framework technology framework and that directly influences our depth and breadth in products because we once we have those technology underlying that is common we are able to move fast to seize opportunities and develop new products that's something that i mentioned as uh, the dynamism in the economy itself and similar situation landscapes over faces where we have a very complex landscape of competition we have 50 plus products each of them have many different competitors and we have to respond quickly to market uh, situations and we have to quickly respond to customer needs and we are able to do that because of that common platform that i mentioned well, common technology framework in which that allows us to have both depth and breadth in our product portfolio normally compare companies that acquire a lot to put them together will have the breadth they will say we cover all of these but they lack that depth because they don't have that common uh, platform things don't work together well. and which brings a point where we provide deep contextual integration across our products so our products are not only deep in themselves but there is also a depth in integration and increasingly more and more integrated for example right now i'm presenting it from backstage using zoho show and all of these work together they just work and finally this is actually the most important part we have invested strongly we are investing strongly in a support system and a partner ecosystem and even more importantly now in the last 2 years we have taken a strong stance of investing locally and this is important to us i will highlight and this strategy that we call transnational localism and what we mean by that is we want to invest in local everything local data centers uh, local support uh, and local marketing local product management often in some cases depending on the region lot of these we are investing in now in order to make sure that our customers are served locally and are very uh, successful in their implementations and that has been the the philosophy that's driving us and increasingly our investments are directed towards us and you'll hear more about this in our press conference later today we are announcing some new initiatives in uh, uae market so this is our uh, uh, philosophy that us uh, that vitally matters so the technology is there the products are there the integration is there but this localism gives you much stronger uh, support network and partner network and you can call on people people can come and implement all of these are will be provided and all of these are behind why we are able to run a vast complex global company like zoho on the zoho platform entirely now zoho runs on zoho this whole event is put together on our own uh, system entirely and um, that is not easy to do us in fact either we'll go over all of this in greater depth in this presentation we have over 9500 employees and a global footprint and now with the pandemic our number of offices have also exploded actually we have opened 15 more local offices all over the world um including in india of course and uh, all over the world we are opening offices now and that makes it even more complex to manage on a technology platform like zoho's evolution is actually driven by our own need for it the fact that we need all this makes it mandatory that we invest in all this so we are inviting investing in remote work powerful remote work tools we are investing in the ability to collaborate across geographies all of these are getting better and better and that is all this powered by our own platform which tells you how when you run it on your business what zoho can do for you and thank you very much